Hello everybody, Super Baby Mario here. Welcome back to Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy at random. What's up, Toad? A letter from Lugert. Oh, am he is stup stup a tree. Yep, that's that's how words work. But then again. Yeah, okay. I I don't actually need I was gonna say, do you not have another letter for me? From one Princess Peach? Hooray. So, that... That, uh, that gives us... Either eight or nine options. It gives us eight options, because the comet is not back at, uh... At Battle Rock Galaxy yet, so... Forgot to actually get out my dice before starting the recording, because I'm, I'm bad at this, apparently. We got option number seven, which means we're going to the bread room. Hooray. Option number seven will be this galaxy right here, which is... Oh, that's not what I thought it was. Okay. <sighs> well... Well... Well, I'm, I'm sure you guys know by now how I feel about deserts, and uh, this is no exception. As far as I can remember, this first star isn't too bad, but the other two were, uh, they're, they're kind of iffy. The music here isn't even that great, which is... You know, a crime in and of itself, but, uh, you know what makes up for it? This animation right here. It's so great. And, uh, yeah, if you, if you pause, you can see that Mario has grown two extra arms. Specifically for the purposes of doing a spinny spin. Because as we all know, it, I almost didn't make that, wow. Everything is, in fact, better with spinning. But yeah, just uh, move around with the stick. You can get out of your uh, get out of your helicopteriness by uh, by ground pounding. Not too complicated. And now we've got underground something down here. Uh oh, nope, bad. Did not mean to break that or that. Okay, this this is going this is going poorly. Uh, is there anything like up above this swamp here? Can I even? I can even. Ha ha. Uh. The hell do you mean I can't crawl under there? Nonsense. Uh, life mushroom that I don't think I'll need. Come on, come on, coin. And yes, there was also a one up there that I could have gotten, but uh, did not feel like it, so therefore, no. I would rather have all the star bits. Oh, right. Yeah, that's, that's death sand. Why does there have to be death sand? Oh. Oh, I see. That's that's how you're supposed to do this. Now it all makes sense. Vaguely. Okay, so in between uh, in between sessions, I did move my sensor bar to the top of the TV, and uh, that seems to have helped somewhat. There's still the odd like stutter with the pointer, but uh, it's definitely a lot less frequent than it was before, so... Maybe, maybe we, maybe the pointer and I have gotten over our differences. For right now. Maybe. Uh, what do you mean those are only there for a limited amount of time? 
That wasn't part of the deal. This wasn't no limited time only deal. There, this, there's, there was no fine print that I'm aware of. Maybe I just didn't read it. Ooh, hello. You're new. New being a relative term, of course, because obviously the Fire Flower has been in many Mario games before this. And, uh... I gotta say, I really don't care for it much in this game. Oh, this, this is, this is gonna go horribly wrong, isn't it? Surprisingly, no. But yeah, not, not a huge fan of the Fire Flower. It was kind of pointless there, having it at all. Unless the, the point there was to... Oh my. Oh. Oh, I only had one chance to grab those star bits, I see. Unless I go back down. But yeah, I'm, I'm guessing the point there was to, um... To use the fire flower to break the uh, the boulder that's chasing you, but like you don't really have to do that at all. But as you saw, the fire flower in this game is only uh, it only works for a limited amount of time, which I think is really silly. But it does make sense with like when you compare it to the rest of the power ups in this game, I guess. Except not really, because the, the bee and boo mushrooms, those both work indefinitely. Until you get hit. I don't know. Also, I guess I... I, I guess I kind of uh, failed my, my self-imposed quote-unquote challenge of not grabbing the fire flower until, uh, until I absolutely needed to. But it's easy enough to get at, to get, like, to get through that section without it anyway. I don't really see the point in that. Okay, pointer, pointer, pointer! Speaking of not seeing the point in that! Um... Excuse me? There we go. As much as I may not like this galaxy, it seems to be trying to win me over with all the all the star bits it's been giving me. So, I, I will, we can, we can coexist in peace for now. Why did, why did Mario not wall jump there? You know, I, I was just about to complain about how slow this, this galaxy is, but, uh, there's our star. And it only took, like, seven or eight minutes. Hooray, I guess. There's our new storybook chapter, and a new Hungry Luma. I, uh, do not know offhand what galaxy that opens. But, uh, let me, let me just add that to my list here. And, uh, let, let me, let me double check with this guy here. Make sure I have the, uh, the amount of options I think I have. All right, with that addition, we now have 10 options available to us. So, we are going to option number two, which is back into Space Junk Galaxy we go. Hello, Luma. We'll get to you later. Whee! 
Oh, what do you mean I didn't get to bounce on the blue Luma? The Bluma, if you will. And this is actually the last time we'll be going to Space Junk Galaxy, because we just have, uh, yeah, no, go away, Comet. All we have left is the Secret Star. We're almost done with this galaxy. For a very long time, at least. But, uh, there's our, there's our question mark, and Pointer, I had just finished saying how the two of us had, uh, had resolved our differences, but no, apparently you want to you want to continue to be difficult. Just while, just while I'm recording. No other time. Which is really par for the course, I, I suppose. Must always collect every available star bit. Hashtag no star bits left behind. Uh, no, I was clearly pointing at the other pole star there, game. Alright, how many do you need? Is it 50? It's probably 50. Sure is. Okay. Well, I suppose we'll have to descend into the depths of this here planet. Not that they're all that deep depths, but still, you know. You know how it would be. Maybe. I'm not sure I do. Eh? Oh my word, that is a Goomba. Clearly the most fearsome beast known to Mario kind. What, what is the point of the pole star there? Like, are you trying to imply that I can't make it out of this without... Okay, the... The, the controls were being kind of weird there, but... See, I can make it out. With slight difficulty. Oh, and there are, there are star bits here also. Uh, there, there's the Luma. Hello, friend. So hungry. Uh, you can have one, because that is the most that the pointer will allow. I, I was, uh, I, I was gonna attempt to stop it at 49, but that would have just been mean. Oh, hello. How do you do, Yoshi Planetoid? With... Bunch of really bad, like, Goomba-shaped acne, it seems. So yeah, I, I feel like our, uh, our objective here is pretty obvious. Stomp on all of them there, Gooms. And, uh, that, that'll, that'll do ya. I, I don't... Okay, now that's just that's just uncalled for. I don't think I really understand the purpose of the uh, the counter that pops up after you uh, stomp multiple goombs in a row. I I don't know if you get anything for a certain amount of consecutive stomps. Or if it's just for funsies, but, uh, The hell do you mean I wasn't grabbing that star? Nonsense! Well, that'll do it. That, 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 That'll do it for Space Junk Galaxy for right now. You got a hidden star. I do not want to save. I do, however, want to see... I guess I can just do this. No comment, which means we're back down to eight options. So we are going to option number one. We're gonna go save Louie. I suppose he's waited on a tree long enough. You know how much he's gonna complain. 
if we leave him too long. Here we are. Hoop! No, I don't know what that was. It wasn't like my battle cry or anything. It was just hoop! B Mario takes flight. Well, he won't be taking flight very much. Not, uh, not here. I, I don't think. I don't... I'm pretty sure I don't need the, uh... Or no, he's up here, isn't he? I, I don't actually remember which tree it is that, uh, that Lester is hanging on. Okay, Pointer, you're, you're being even worse than before. What's going on with you, bud? You know what, I'm not even gonna... Not even gonna activate the bee mushroom. That's how confident I am. Uh, does that not give me a vine? Okay, I'm slightly less confident now. Oh! Oh, I can go up here. Well, that's cool. Uh, does there happen to be a... a scared green man hanging out in this, this here tree? Does not appear to be so. Pointer, what is even going on with you right now? Like, you were being so good earlier when I was in the menu. Not even the menu for this game, just the Wii U menu. Okay, you know what, Rock? Fine, you get to frickin' live. For now, at least. Is, uh, is this coin gonna sta stab? Is it gonna spawn a rainbow star? It sure is. Okay. Now you all get to die. As, uh, as soon as I can figure out how to... How to control Mario properly. Yeah. Who's the boulder now? It's not you, you're just you you've been reduced to pebbles. No, no, no. Um Do I seriously need to become a bee for this? Because, like, I, I'd really rather not. I know it's possible to get up here, but it is, uh... not the easiest of things. I also don't remember how. It's, uh... Oh, come on! Come on, you can do it. You, you can... you can not... okay. <laughs> no, don't make me do it. Why are you making me do it? <sighs> Fine. You know what? You've you've forced my hand. I'm gonna. Yeah, no. There's no way I can make it over there from uh, from the ledge there. I suppose I'll. Suppose I shall become a bumblebee, if I must. That was, uh, not a thing I was, uh, not a thing I thought I was going to be able to do, but it worked out. Please don't get crushed. I know Rock is good against Bug, which means we're, uh, we're going to want to, we're going to want to dodge roll out there. That, uh... That really shouldn't have worked either, but here we are. Um...
Wait, uh, yeah, about our, uh, our bro Lugnut. Where- there he is! Uh, can I just, uh... Okay, maybe- maybe if the camera was pointed the right way. Yeah! What big scary bug? I mean, I, I guess he is larger than average in terms of bugs, but he's like, he, he's still there. Uh, or sh he should have still been, th why is he not there? Now I'm confuzzled. Okay, whatever. And that's another galaxy cleared for the time being. Ooh, a new one. Oh ho! Let me just add that to the list here. All right. Well. Comet is back, so uh, we now have nine options. So, where's... Where's theirs? There we are. We're doing option number four! We're going back to Gusty Garden Galaxy. Excellent. You will never hear me complain about that. What is our, uh, our second objective here? We've got the dirty tricks of Major Burrows. I see. I see. I see. I forgot that. Uh, forgot that this was a thing. To be perfectly honest, it seems like it should be something that's like earlier in the game. Yes. If that makes any sense. If I make any sense, just in general. Okay, that's that's cool. I didn't need that coin. Everything's fine. We got buns. Not the moles. Those big joiks. Yeah, you've you've told me about floaty fluff. Actually, it, it may not have been that exact bun, but uh, it was a similar one in Rainbow Star. Yeah! Rainbow Star really just shows up in a surprising number of worlds. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty great. Or, excuse me, galaxies, not worlds. What am I, what am I thinking? This ain't no Mario world. Not even a Mario 3D world. Who do I think I'm kidding? Yeah, this is this is fine. How <laughs> Okay, now now gravity's being weird. Okay. Where where are we where are we going? Oh, this was a mistake, wasn't it? Yeah, you know, let me <laughs> Can I... can I aim for the apple? No? I, okay. Goodbye. I don't know what I expected, but it, it was not that. And now I'm here for some reason. What is this? How did I get here? No, no, seriously, how, how did I... I don't even know. Uh-oh. Okay. Is this, uh... Is this a kill-all-enemies planet? I feel like it might be. 
Because, like, I, I really should have... There, there should have been, like, a launch star or something waiting for me. Were it not a... Just ran straight into that. I was staring at the mole. But the question is, which of these moles is the third strongest? We may never find out, given that they don't speak. Don't speak! Yeah, there it is. Uh... That it, I, I might have gone past it. Here we are, everything's fine, we just need to... What, what in the name of all that is holy is this? Ah yes, it is of course the... A, a spot for even more star bit farming. Because that's what I need more of in my life. What is the pointer doing? Speaking of things I don't need more of, I don't need more pointer glitches. Really getting tired of this. And it's only episode 10. We're only a third of the way through the game. We, we like, seriously, we just got our 40th star. I can math. 40 is a third of 120. Anyways, time for giant apple. And, uh, you ready for something horrifying? Apparently Mario isn't because he doesn't want to activate it. Yeah, there it is. H have you ever thought about what, what could be living in your apples? I really don't get why stomping on specific stumps here is what causes the caterpillar to move, but... Uh, yes? Okay, you... you go have fun. Have fun existing. Elsewhere. Why, why is there a boulder on this apple? Why are there two boulders on this apple? Uh... Are you, uh, you gonna eat me? Can you eat me? I don't think you can. Okay, well you don't, you don't seem to mean any harm, so, uh... Let's just be on our way, then. I'm, I'm probably not going to need that, but... Then again, I've, I've said that on... more than one occasion where I actually have. But it's fine. This... It's just a big mole who looks like you... He, he just looks more cuddly than anything. See, look, look at, he, he just needs a hug. That's what he needs. He doesn't need fisticuffs. So yeah, if you, uh, in, in case you can't tell, this, this here is Major Burroughs, and, uh, now he's really pissed off. I didn't get no allowance today, so now I'm really ticked off. So yeah, you, as you can probably tell, you, you can't, you shouldn't ground pound until he gets out of the ground, because otherwise you can't do anything to him, and what do you know? It was as easy as I thought it was. I do know what I'm talking about sometimes. What's up, boyoing boyoing?
That one means business. It said boyong twice. Anyways. It is a star! Yeah! It's a star! And with that, uh, sure, we'll save our game. Why not? Because that's gonna be the end. As soon as I, uh, you know, get Rosalina to continue to teach me to read. Oh my god, Mario. Chapter 5, Home. The kitchen will go here, and the library will go over there, the girl said busily to herself. We'll put the gate here. Ever since the girl took Luma under her care, she'd been bustling about at a feverish pace. It's a lot of work, but it's worth it to make a happy home. It turned out that star bits weren't the only things buried in the ice. There were tools and furniture unlike any they had ever seen, and the girl used them to build a home. Looking at the completed house, Luma remarked, Don't you think it's awfully big for just the two of us? With a library, bedroom, kitchen, fountain, and gate, it was certainly spacious, but still, something seemed to be missing. If only my father, brother, and mother were here, the girl said wistfully. Indeed, the house was too large for its two small residents. That night, clutching her favorite stuffed bunny close to her heart, the girl fell asleep in the starship. <laughs>